You are watching a Devil TV with the Asus EPC 1215B, which is a new AMD Brothers um, netbook with a 12.1 inch screen. And I'm going to show you how to upgrade the RAM and hard drive space on this nice little device. And as you can see here on the bottom, we already opened up the whole thing and I have a lot of screws lying around here. So to upgrade the RAM, all you need to do is take off this little rubber part and uh, unscrew this one little fella right here. And then you can just lift up this um, plate and then you have your RAM right there which is two times two gigabytes right now and it will be upgradable to um, two times four gigabytes so there is a maximum of eight gigabytes of RAM available in this sa in this um, device should cost you around eighty dollars to upgrade that so to take out one of these just push these metal arms here to the side and then it pops out like this and then you can just take it out and as you can see here it's a Hynix right now, and it's 2 gigabytes DDR3 sodium RAM. To put it back in, make sure that all the metal, uh, the golden legs aren't visible when you push it back inside the device, and then just press it down to the mainboard till it clicks, and then you're all finished. Put back on the lid, screw back in at one screw, and you're done. For the hard drive, it's a little bit more tricky. You need to unscrew 22 of these <laughs> screws in this device and there is actually three layers that you have to get through so there's three screws right here and one is be below the uh, RAM just check out the pictures on the devil.com for that and there's another two tiny screws right here behind the battery after you are done with those you have to open up your netbook and start uh, taking by taking off the front part, so the, the touchpad, just take one plastic card you don't need anymore and go around the, device or around the device like that and then you can just take this off. After you are done with that, there's another four screws waiting for you here on the bottom. You have to take out those and then it shouldn't be a problem to take out the keyboard also. It's a little bit um, glued on here with double sided tape but that's not too hard to get off. Then there's another seven screws that you have to get off this metal plate which uh, acts as a heatsink actually. Let me show you which seven those are. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six and seven. So that's all the screws which have a tiny little um, triangle. And below the right one, uh, on the right one, uh, on the right bottom here there will be a warranty void sticker so after you do this upgrade your warranty will be probably void but I'm not sure you should ask ASUS before you start upgrading your hard drive. After that you can see here you have the 500 gigabyte Western Digital Scorpion built in and there's another four screws that you have to get rid of. Just take them out and then you can just slide out the hard drive to the right like this and just lift it up and you are all done taking out the hard drive. You can upgrade that to an SSD or anything else you wish you want. And what I find inter interesting about this device is that the AMD processor is right here. So you can take a closer look at that in this video. That's all that is there to it. There's no space for um, a PCI. There's no uh, empty PCI Express slot. The wireless card is below this cable though. So yeah, there's not too much space in here. And this is actually it from the <laughs> um, Asus 1215B uh, hard drive and RAM upgrade. I hope you enjoyed it um, and you aren't scared of doing this for yourself. But as I said, um, it's all on your own risk. And yeah, good luck upgrading. My name is Balash Gal and you were watching Devil TV with the Asus EPC 1215B.